Last month, more arrests are expected. Now the theft ring is suspected of stealing copper along Highway 1 near Greenville and more phone lines were cut along Highway 12. In Bolivar County, dozens of unwanted pets were scooped up today by some animal lovers from another state. WSVT Steve Dreyer is live in your newsroom with more on this animal rescue mission in Cleveland. Steve. Earl, today in Cleveland, an animal-friendly organization teamed up with the Cleveland Bolivar County Animal Shelter to send some of its four-legged friends on a journey. Today, animals from all over the Delta are coming together and sent off to a new home and hundreds of miles away. Their journey begins in Cleveland and ends in Colorado, but there is always a cost. Dial Stanley, Director in Defense of Animals, says it isn't a cheap trip. The cost of the transport is $1,800. It's paid for exclusively by donations. But the cost of readying the animals for transport, that's astronomical. This two-week-old black lab is going to make the long journey in the back of Enterprise truck thanks to the Defense of Animals League. And they're going to the state of Colorado where they will be adopted and hand-raised along with 60 other animals, cats and dogs alike, anywhere from two weeks old to the age of 17 years of age, will be making this long journey across the country. Gary Singley, director of the Cleveland Bolivar County Animal Shelter, says this is a great program to have, but we still have a human to pet population ratio that is still too high. Um, we did a study, or a study was done several years ago here uh, within this area in the Delta, and for every individual, there's about nine dogs, and that's just dogs. There are about nine dogs for every individual. Many of these pets will be adopted within two weeks after arriving in Colorado. If you'd like to adopt one, contact your local animal shelter and make sure to get your pets spayed or neutered. If you'd like to donate your time, money, or pet food, please call the number on your screen or visit the website. Live in Yuan Ruznum, Steve Dreyer, WXVT, Delta News. Thanks a lot, Steve. Well, in Gunnison,